Dia de los Muertos is a celebration in Mexico and Central America and um, some of the northern um, South American countries, um, Andean region, that remembers and celebrates the life of those who have passed on before us. So my goal by um, talking about and celebrating Dia de los Muertos in our, my classes is for students to have um, appreciation and an understanding of how different societies understand the concept of life and death and the afterlife. Dia de los Muertos is having a day to connect with the dead. They come over on this day. If you put up an ofrenda this year, uh, as a family, we made an ofrenda. Uh, we did it very traditionally, which is this little platform where we put food, their favorite things, uh, the pictures of them, uh, the four elements. That way they can cross over and we can uh, reconnect with them. So we look at the ways people celebrate um, modern day, and that is a lot of different ways. Some people set up ofrendas for their loved ones in their homes to remember them. Some people go to cemeteries and they have a big community party in the cemetery, which is something that seems very um, unique and different to us, but the idea is to understand the perspectives of others and why they do what they do and so that we can appreciate each other. So this past week or so, we went on a field trip to Maddie Roads where we had very, very good, tasty uh, Mexican food. And then we went to this museum over Day of the Dead, and we uh, visited a lot of ofrendas, very different uh, types. Uh, some were traditional with multiple tiers, uh, the same framework. Some were, uh, yes, of Mexican descent, uh, but a lot were representing many different cultures, um, different, all had different styles, some were painted, some were built. Dia de los Muertos, why is it important? Well, there is a, a kind of a Mexican saying that we, we die three times and the third death is the one that is final. The first time is when our spirit leaves our body. The second is when um, we are buried and our um, body returns to the earth. And the third and the sad, most saddest one, the final one, is when we're forgotten. So as long as we are remembering our loved ones, they are always alive. So that's what Dia de los Muertos is, is remembering to keep somebody's spirit alive, to keep history alive, um, and to be thankful for the people in our lives. <laughs>